I'm going to show you how to make shaved ice Minnesotan style. For the bowls of ice, get two bowls of differing sizes. Start by filling the larger bowl. Continue to fill it until it's near the top. Then you can let some of the water flow into the smaller bowl until they are level. Fill it up a little bit more until the water level is near the edge. Then tape the bowls together so that they stay in place while they're freezing. So I'm actually going to do this for the other ones while they are outside so that it's easier to carry. Top off the outer bowl, then a little bit more on the inner bowls to sink them down. Then let them freeze overnight. Hopefully the squirrels and the cats won't get to the water before it freezes. I'm going to start by making a pile of snow on one end so I can put LED flashlights in the snow to light up the shaved ice syrup bottles. Now we'll let that freeze solid so that we can drill in the spots for the flashlights after it's frozen. Time to uncover the bowls and get those ready. Looks pretty nice. For these ones, looks like we might need to bring them inside and let them thaw out a little bit to loosen up the bowls. Now I'm going to go set them back outside. Use a one and a half inch drill bit. Don't drill all the way down because it will put a hole in the bottom. And then use the ice that is being shaved for the shaved ice. You could just put that in the frozen bowl. And these buckets are for the extra shaved ice. Now for the final setup, then we'll turn on the lights and invite the family outside. And the reason I'm leaving this snow here is so that these don't slide off. And now for the lights. Alright, time to serve it up. What flavor do you want? Got strawberry, lime, orange, cherry, blue raspberry, and grape. I'll take grape. Okay. Can I have half and half? Sure. What do you want for your other half? Uh, I want the lemon lime. Thank you. You are welcome. Mmm, what's good? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Alright. Alison, you want some? I'll take blue raspberry grape. There you go. Thank you. And make sure to subscribe and watch more Minnesota Cold and how-to videos of ours.